That's the mystery. This is day two. Oh, it's got something. Somebody's stopping in. Look at this, look at that. Another day at the mountains. That's a good experiment. So, so I knew, you know, and it could have been a coincidence. No, but I don't think it's the third was. time. Because after I'm playing with some of these other things that produce these insane effects, I can tell that it wasn't to be around for so long. Good, I've been waiting for you. You haven't waited for you. You've been promised never when you come to eat You can do metal. That's what it is. What's going on here? I just didn't know. Now it's open. Must be some secrets going on back here. Russ is back here. They're talking about a few things. I think this gentleman. I don't want everybody to hear, but that's okay. <laughs> 
outside my balcony. I really like the way those clouds look over there. I would love to go climb on those things. They, uh, they, they thought that they went beyond absolute zero and then showed that there was an anti-entropic force Present. I don't know if anybody else read about that, but it was uh, it was talked about in, in the universities and everything. This shape, the torus, which comes out of uh, background the charge of the primary battery, that's where you can get really very interesting. Uh, what I'll play with that in the lab. What I want to do is, is help you engineer a box that can can be a 48 volt battery charger that uses. I mean, Pictures. Okay, make a funny face. Uh, <laughs> awesome. Raw bush, baby. In the flesh. In the Raw flesh. bush. Here at BM with Russ. Just finished watching one of the best uh, talks here this this week so far. We'll be good, man. Thanks. Thank you. I will. I was only dreaming of seeing this for many years. I was Oh, look at this. I'm really impressed. I've been getting stuck because I said I'm not hooked up to the I can slow down. Don't think you're on a damn you know, boat here. Take a picture. Oh, I guess I should. <laughs> it's going to shake so many. Nobody can. <laughs> think we're on a boat.
And I have a good, a good uh, video on my website of actually having a struggle that I used to have. Casting, business, machine, it's all extensive open source project. Top. Right now, you're saving money, don't lose it. Uh, I, don't real, I don't have real cards. Yeah, Russ is making some more stuff. Brashmi KD Zero Fossil Fuel on YouTube, and I represent a portion of the breakthrough energy movement where I consider myself to be a member of boots on the ground in terms of motivating and energizing other people to get out and try and build something, to educate them, and to uh, attempt to build it myself because uh, we're all working toward the same goal. Um, to divorce ourselves from, as Dana said, the manacles that uh, we have traditionally held, held to. And we believe that a true breakthrough energy, in order for a true breakthrough energy to reach critical mass in society, it must be released in a very big way, very suddenly, very reproducible, and everything that I publish on YouTube is published open source freely to all mankind for no charge, as well as uh, the, the work that Russ does here. Uh, we are very much brethren in that regard, and uh, we are working very hard to produce a alternative solution that would allow us to divorce ourselves from the economic constraints that we are currently shackled to. And if we can just put together pieces of it as a group, we can move the entire development, developmental process forward so much faster when we work together as a group and in, in like mind together. Um, I have been approached by many of you here at the conference who, who want to share your ideas with me. I've shared everything that I can with you. Uh, I do that through the YouTube videos, through live broadcasts, and by answering as many emails as I can when people do write to me with questions. Uh, I've looked into infinite number of uh, alternative energy technologies. Some of them are viable, some not, but I'm, like Mark Dancy, testing what is viable, testing what is not, hopefully creating, helping to create a solution that will allow us to be truly free from the bonds that, that shackle us to our society. Russ Grease, for those of you who don't know me. Basically, I'm, I'm a younger zero fossil fuel guy here. And uh, it's interesting, I ran across some of his videos and I somehow just see a younger, I'm a, I'm a younger him. It's pretty, it's, it's pretty interesting, actually. Um, my, my talk today was basically the only reason you're here, and that's because somebody told you. My, uh, my speech was about open source and sharing of information. Um, basically, you're here because somebody told you, and that's sharing of information. What it comes down to is that's an open source idea uh, in my mind. So everything that I do is open source in the manner of sharing information freely. Because if we do not share information, we, we will not learn. And everybody has got to do everything they can with individuals as a group. And that's why we're all here right now. So short and sweet, my basic uh, principle is share, help people, and, and you will receive the same thing, and, and it's pretty amazing. If you've never had the experience just to openly, freely help somebody, and, and not do it because you want something, but do it because you're interested in helping that person, you'll get, a, you'll get a greater gift back from somebody or something will happen to you that's just astounding, so um, just keep that principle in mind, but Open source, baby. That's why we're here, sharing information. Yeah.